everyone. This is your boy J Rock here, and we are back with Persona 5 War Part 3. So we now have the rest of the line. Yes! Okay, let's go. Is this some kind of filming? Who is in charge here? You're mine. We're all locked down. That was Should you right. Let's go. This will end. Okay. That enemy was really weak. Intruder. Hamoshida? Who's that? More importantly, what is this place? Why is the school turned into something like this? I can't believe you mistook my aunt for someone like her. <laughs> Are you afraid? What is that outfit? Have you lost your mind? I do as I please here. After all, this is my castle. The world of my desires. What the... Wait. Is this some red light district? What a lively slave. This isn't funny! Enough of the bullshit, Kamoshida! <laughs> the girls decided to tell me off. What do you think of that? Talking back is, like, totally unforgivable. In that case, she should be executed. <gasps> now then, how should I play with you? Shall I tear you into little pieces? Are you kidding me? This is effed up. Is that what he thinks of the girls on the volleyball team? Hey, that's... Takamaki! Just when I was about to start enjoying myself. What's the deal with this guy? You little... How many times are you gonna come back? I bet you just like those thieves. You came because you're pissed at me, huh? But, uh... Ah, I forget that chick's name. But it's your fault she jumped, you know. Huh? You were so reluctant to throw yourself onto me that I had her take your place. You bastard! <laughs> no! Take one more step and I'll kill her on the spot. Damn it! Just sit back and enjoy the dismantlement show. No, don't! Maybe I'll start with the clothes. <laughs> You're such a perv! Hey, what are we gonna do? Takamaki! Is this... my punishment for what happened to Shio? That's more like it. You should have looked like this from the start. Shio... I'm so sorry. Huh? You're right. Letting this piece of shit toy with me? <laughs> what was I thinking? It's like I always say, slaves should just behave and... Shut up! I've had enough of this. You pissed me off, you son of a bitch! 
my, it's taken far too long. Here we go. Tell me, who is going to avenge her if you don't? Forgiving him was never the option. Such is the scream of the other you that dwells with you. I am thou, thou art I. We can finally forge a contract. I hear you, Carmen. You're right! No more holding back! <laughs> there you go. Nothing can be solved by restraining yourself. Understand? Then I'll gladly lend you my strength. <laughs> Not some cheap girl you can toy with, you scumbag. Bitch! You stole everything from Shiho. You destroyed her. Now it's your turn! I will rob you of everything! How dare you! Enough of your insolence! No, I've had enough of you! No one's gonna stop me now! Let's go, Carmen! <laughs> like the <laughs> How dare you deny King Kamoshida's love, you selfish lass! Pay for this insolence with your life! That dirtbag just sees women as sexual outlets! Don't make me laugh with that love bullshit! Come on, Carmen! Let's give him hell! Let's do this! Dance, Carmen! You did it! They're going flat! Let's get serious! Finish up! Persona! I said! Ravage them! Flip him, Persona! Here, man, and more importantly, how? Hey, is that how you speak to a woman? Are you all right, Lady On? Lady On? Wait, what is this thing? Is it alive? How can it talk? And where in the world are we? J just calm down. Everything's going to be okay. Don't worry. How am I supposed to calm down? H huh? Am I dressed like this? When did I? <sighs> What's with this? Huh? What are you talking about? Hmm. What the hell are you thinking? Well, I'm stumped. A search party will be coming for us soon. 
There's no time to explain. We don't have a choice. Let's retreat for now. We were just getting fired up and you had to go and get in the way. <sighs> Fine. Here, give me your arm. You take the other side. Thanks. Looks like we made it back. Hey, are you okay? Well, pretty much. Wait, I lied. I'm still confused about all of this. You may be safe now, but a lot sure did happen back there. At any rate, we stand out too much here. Let's relocate to a safer spot. Which one you want? Whichever's not carbonated. Uh, they're both actually. Then... Here you go. What about me? Huh? But uh, you're a cat. <laughs> Have you calmed down, Lady On? Um... Morgana, right? I really am talking to a cat. <sighs> this feels so strange. Oh, sorry. You're not a cat, right? It's only natural that you're confused. Mm. Demanding that you understand all of this right after what you went through is asking too much. Honestly, I still can't believe what happened. And that power. My persona. It's the will of your rebellion, Lady On. With it, you'll be able to fight in that other world. So if what you told me is true, we can make Kamoshida have a change of heart, right? Is it really possible? Can we actually force him to confess his crimes? The volleyball team's keeping quiet about this while teachers and parents turn a blind eye. If guys like us try and complain, they're just gonna shoot us down. Going all in on this plan is the only choice we got. Then let me help too. I want to make him pay for what happened to Shiho. He just keeps going like nothing happened, even after what he did to her. I'll never forgive him. Wait, did you just say, let me help? You mean you want us to take you along? Don't act like I'm going to drag you down. Weren't you watching? I can fight too. Hey, what should we do? I agree as well. We are lacking in manpower after all. Don't worry, I'll protect her. Even if you said no, I'd just go in alone. Ah, right, she can go by herself. I guess it'd be more dangerous turning her down. Ah, uh, fine. Then it's decided. Well, I hope we get along. I'm going to make Kamoshida atone for what he did. Not just for Shiho's sake, but for everything he's done. I won't let any more people suffer because of him. I'll do whatever it takes. A group like yours must have relied on subtlety and misdirection. Otherwise, you'd never survive. Some of you might even have been hiding behind a public face their entire lives. If you're listening, then answer me. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the lover's persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. All right. Just let me know when you're heading back in. Oh, wait. We don't have each other's info. Hey, give me your number and chat ID. And, um... I'll be counting on you then. Same goes for you, Morgana. The pleasure is all mine, Lady On. What a kind girl. Such admirable consideration for others. 
and the innocence to cast herself into the jaws of death to achieve her goal. She cares about her friends, and she's beautiful to boot. What a girl. She's captured my heart. Dude. You know, it'd be better if this group could get together quick from now on. True. Our best option would be to make a secret hideout where we could discuss these things. A hideout, huh? I like the sound of that. The school rooftop would work. It seems like nobody goes up there. For the time being, that will make the perfect hideout. I can't contact you from inside a palace, so I'll stay in this world. That being said, I'll need someone to take care of me. I'm personally nominating you. You should feel honored. This is all you. There's no way I can at my place. The train will be arriving soon. Well, we now have our hideout, so let's meet there tomorrow. Okay, let's go look at my new residence for this world. Stay upstairs while we're open for business. Yes? Hey, lay off the customers. Sorry if he was rude, Doctor. I don't mind. Come on, you're getting in the way. Go on upstairs. Thanks. I'll see you later. Come back again. <laughs> That's it for today. Oh, that customer just now? She's the head doctor over at that clinic down the street. Rumor has it she gives pretty crappy examinations and sells some weird homemade medicines on top of that. At least, that's what I've heard. I haven't been there myself. They should really just leave her alone. It's not like she's getting in the way of their lives. Hey, are we there yet? <sighs> well, I gotta get home and start making dinner. What the? What is this place? Is this some kind of abandoned house? Hey, are you... I was wondering why I heard meowing. What did you bring it here for? That's... It's a shame. Look, this place is a restaurant. Animals are a no-go. Though, I guess you might stay on good behavior if you've got a pet to take care of. Fine. But keep it quiet when we're open for business. And don't let it roam downstairs, or I'll toss it out. Oh, and I'm not going to take care of it. That's all on you. Was that the ruler of this place? He seemed pretty understanding for someone who keeps you cramped up in this dump. Then again, I suppose to normal people I just sound like a meowing cat. <sighs> Seriously. I had to keep calling out in that cute little voice. Make sure you wash that dish. By the way, uh, have you decided on a name? Morgana? Huh. I was hoping I'd get to name it. Looks like the Chief likes me better than you. And to be honest, this place is heaven compared to Kamoshida's cells. Remember how you guys asked me before about what I am? To be honest, I don't remember anything about my birth. I think the metaverse's distortions made me lose both my memories and my true form. I already told you, I'm an honest-to-God human. If I were originally just a cat, how could I talk? It doesn't make any sense. There's no doubt that the distortions were what caused me to lose my real self. I'm sure that once they're purged, I'll finally be able to get that self back. And I have a pretty good idea on how to do it, too. That's why I was in the castle in the first place. Come to think of it, I didn't get hungry over in that world. Let me make myself clear. Your taking care of me won't be for nothing. It'll be give and take, due to my knowledgeable and dexterous nature. I have a lot of intel on infiltration tools. Whoa. I can't tell you more unless we settle on a deal. In exchange for you keeping me here, I'll teach you about these tools. How does that sound? 
I like that answer. <laughs> then it's a deal. Skillful infiltrations and escapes to all manner of places. There's even the possibility that you use special tools and had someone who manufactured them. Answer me. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the Magician Persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. All right. I'll lecture you about the infiltration tools over time. By the way, the power you used in the palace was seriously amazing. The stronger that power gets, the more reliable it'll be as a trump card. All right, I'm gonna stick with you wherever you go from today on. Personas are the strengths born from one's heart. Depending on what kind of life experience you gain, I bet it'll affect that power as well. And if you become acquainted with capable people, you might learn various useful skills too. This is all part of our deal, got it? I expect great things from you. Don't let me down, okay? You guys send messages to each other with that thing, right? I want in too. So, I'm gonna have to ask you to type for me. Are you listening? Looks like we're all here. Okay, let's get going. Hold on, it's still too early for us to head to the palace. But why? Don't we just gotta steal that treasure thing? Don't underestimate the dangers of that place. We need to prepare. Ain't that persona shit we got enough to deal with it? That's exactly what I mean when I say don't underestimate it. You'll die if you mess up in there. So again, we need to prepare before we head in. But how exactly are we supposed to do that? I'm glad you asked, Lady On. First, we'll need to find better equipment for all of you. You talking about weapons? Oh, I know a kick-ass place. In that case, you can handle that side of things. The only other thing would be stocking up on medicine. Fatigue is unavoidable in a palace. And where can we get medicine? Don't worry, I know just the place. I hope you look forward to it, Lady On. Now then, he and I have some business in Yongen, so let's head off for today. 
Just come with me. I won't be able to get close enough by myself. Can I talk? Actually... Hey! This is the clinic that the Chief mentioned. Now, how can we get them to give us some medicine? Well, I guess that's the only choice we have. We'll just have to go for it. All right, let's step inside. Well... Please head to the exam room. In a case like yours, it's usually just due to stress. I'm gonna prescribe you some pain relievers, okay? Actually, I still need to restock those. So let's go with sleeping pills instead. Sleep is the best medicine anyway. Which type of pill do you want? A sweet tasting one or a bitter one? Is that right? And I bet you think you should have a year long supply of them too. You're not sick at all, are you? I'm not as dumb as I look, you know. I'm guessing you're here because you heard the rumors about me, hmm? Who's to say? But as a result, all I get are patients with ulterior motives now. I guess high school kids have it tough nowadays too, huh? Well, fine. I'll prescribe you some medication. But only medication that will help you recover your health. I guess it's fine. You seem pretty earnest, and you don't look like you'll be any trouble. This is my private practice. All the medicine I dispense is original. I have a license to make my own formulas. You've likely seen them being sold at various hospitals. It's your responsibility to take care of yourself. So, if that's okay with you, stop by any time. Great, it's nice that you're so quick on the uptake. Saves me the hassle. You're a pretty weird kid, you know? I wonder what you're going to use the medicine for. Well, as long as you don't cause me any trouble, it's not my problem. Okay, which one? That should work. Thanks. You want that one? Here you go. That should work. Thanks. You want that one? Here you go. That should work. You want that one? Here you go. That should work. Thanks. Take care.
okay. We might be able to get our hands on some decent stuff if this store really has model guns. Well, we can leave that for tomorrow. Let's go home. Okay. Oh! Okay. Everyone, wake up! This country is twisted. While Japanese society may appear to be thriving, many young people have not been as blessed as their elders. They have no jobs, no savings, no financial security whatsoever. These young people should be tackling their futures head on, but instead, they're too busy merely trying to survive. People give speeches all the time. Plus, politics are pretty boring anyways. Shop can be pretty confusing to find sometimes. Hey! Yeah! Oh yeah, uh, before we head in, you know anything about guns and shit? Nah, I guess we can just ask the guy behind the counter if we can't figure out what we want. Come on, let's do this. <sighs> you looking for recommendations? I don't know, just buy whatever looks interesting to you. Ugh, some customer service. Fine, what do you want? An automatic? A revolver? Uh, automatic? Dude, why are you talking about cars now? Listen, this year's an enthusiast shop. My regulars will be mad if I let a casual like you hang around. I'm not a freaking casual. I bought shit from here like last week. Ah, <sighs> can't remember you. You bastard. And you, looking for something? Oh, you a collector? You're way more interested than Blondie over there. Oh, shut it! Anyways, you should have said before you two are enthusiasts. I'm always up for helping fresh faces. Some precautions first, though. Don't go around pointing them at other people. Keep them in a bag or something if you're outside. Oh, and don't let the fuzz catch wind of you having them. I don't need them coming around here. How about that? Me too. Now, if you look close, you'll be able to tell these are models. Real guns feel... different. Maybe someday I'll show you the real good stuff, though. If you got the guts for it, of course. But for now, you get the beginner selection. Just sit tight, I'll bring him out. <laughs> we did it, dude. We totally gotta go for some fancy shit, right? Oh, I want him to shine. Oh, and here's the cash for mine. Pick me out something good. All right. Sounds good. Hmm, that one? Don't break it, okay? Which one? 
That's what you're choosing? How's that? Sounds good. Hmm, that one? You like it? Alright, which one? That's what you're choosing? How's that? Okay. Sounds good. Mm, that one? You like it? Alright, which one? Sounds good. That's what you're choosing? How's that? one hmm, that one you like it all right sounds good that's what you're choosing how's that all right which one One. You better not use it to pull a prank. Sounds good. That's what you're choosing? You like it? Alright, which one? Hmm, that one? How's that? Okay. Sounds good. Uh, come again. Later. Did you hear? Apparently that subway driver from the accident was acting really odd during his testimony hearing. You talking about that psychotic whatever thing people are going on about? Yeah, I heard it completely alters your personality. The news is saying the driver couldn't even speak when they tried asking him questions. Only an idiot would believe a preposterous story like that. Oh, sorry, but we're closing soon. <laughs> How rude. This must be why you don't get many customers. Your coffee's actually not half bad. The Beans must be lamenting the sorry state of this store. Thanks for stopping in. Please come again. <laughs> I'm only trying to help you fix your business. Thanks for the coffee, at least. Jeez, what a pain. Oh, what do you want? If you're bored, go wash some dishes or something. Cut it. It's all good as long as the shop doesn't fail. I'm not gonna go wearing a fake smile. No, it's nothing like that. As long as I'm here, the world leaves me be. No annoyances or troublesome people to deal with. It's like my own personal hideaway. I'd be kind of screwed if I lost it. But I guess you would be too. So you better at least try and be useful around here. Anyway, I'm leaving now. Don't cause any trouble. We're just about ready to go to the palace. We just need to assemble some infiltration tools. Clean off that desk back there so we can use it. That desk! Hurry now and clean it up! 
Great. Now you can make things whenever you want. I'll provide the materials this time. Try making a lockpick. Don't think too hard about it. You'll get the hang of it. Everyone starts off a little clumsy. Don't be sad if it doesn't go well at first, okay? Great! We should be able to use this. Yeah. We should be ready now. We're heading into the palace tomorrow. Let's get some sleep. Good morning. Come on, hurry up and get to class. Good morning. That admirable behavior won't do you any good once you're expelled. Well, that wraps up the homeroom period. <clears throat> A word with you, please? There's something I'd like to ask you. It won't take long. I see you're already getting on top of the problem I'd mentioned this morning, Miss Kawakami. I appreciate the support. Thank you again. Oh, you know this guy, Yoshizawa? Yes. He lent me a helping hand earlier. I recommend you steer clear of the likes of him if you have any consideration for your future. Remember the discussion we just had? There are a number of students in this school you shouldn't get involved with. This one's at the top of the list. Oh, the delinquent transfer student? Sorry to interrupt, but I need to use the guidance office. Oh, pardon me. We should be going too. Don't want to get in the way of guiding this delinquent and all. Please excuse us. <sighs> After you. I'm gonna get straight to the point. Did something happen between you and Mr. Kamoshida? Well, there was that little exchange just now, but that's not all. He gave me a brief lecture this morning and your name came up. Something about the dangers of a lack of supervision. I don't mean to pry, but just make sure you don't go causing trouble, okay? Oh, and one more thing. That girl outside the office? You didn't make a pass at her, did you? All right. Mr. Kamoshida has a real close eye on you. Apparently, you've been getting involved with Sakamoto-kun. You seem acquainted with Yoshizawa-san as well. Maybe you're just naturally drawn to athletes? Sorry, bad joke. That's all I wanted to discuss. You're free to go. understand that our time limit is May 2nd. We basically just have to go to that castle and steal the treasure from Kamoshida, right? But wait, what even is a treasure? 
I want to know that before we do anything. A treasure is the physical form of the palace ruler's distorted desires. In other words, it's the core of the palace. Once we steal it, the palace will crumble. I think. Having said all that, even I don't know what Kamoshida's treasure is going to be. And where can we find it? There's no way of knowing that until we go in and find out. But if I had to guess, I'd say he has it locked up somewhere in the depths of the palace. I think I get it now. We just gotta find the treasure, yeah? Pretty much. There's just a lot we won't know until we go in. In any case, our objective is to find the treasure's location somewhere in the palace. Make sure we go about this with time to spare so we can avoid any unforeseen circumstances. I expect great things from you guys. All right, I'm gonna bust loose. Damn! Hmm? What's up? N nothing. Uh, I was just thinking we should choose a code name for you, too. A code name? I'm Skull, he's Joker, and that's Mona. Judging by your costume. I mean, she's got that tail and stuff, so. What do you think? <laughs> you're going to call me from now on? I am so not down with this. What do you want to be called then? Um, something better than just a little cat. Maybe... Panther? That sounds pretty cool, doesn't it? Huh? Why? Cause it sounds more... ferocious? She's a cougar. <laughs> Don't call me that! More importantly, Kamoshida. Oh, right. Let's go. All right. Let's start fresh and get going. It's game time from this point forward. I'll teach you guys the basics of infiltrating a palace as we go. My master would like a word with you. The prisoner has returned. Well done. It seems you have remembered my words. You truly make it worth rehabilitating you. <laughs> I am not attempting to withhold information from you. The essence of the rehabilitation that you must complete will be explained in due time. Once you encounter allies who share your ideals and discover your place in reality, only then will I explain it all. Such a day should not be far off. This time, I wish to introduce you to the aid we are providing. Due to your potential in wielding the power of the wild card, you can handle more than one persona. That power holds infinite possibilities. We will assist you in nurturing that potential. To that end, we must execute your persona. <laughs> Do not be alarmed. Personas are personalities that exist within you. Thus, you will only be discarding old personalities to have them be reborn as new ones. By discarding your old identity, you give way to a new one. Hence, we call that process execution. Think of it as the fusion of your personas. To start, select the first persona you wish to fuse. Now, before you select the second persona, allow me to tell you something greatly important. Do you remember how I mentioned forming bonds with confidants? Personas are the power of the heart. The stronger those bonds, the stronger your personas will be. In other words, the effects of your bonds on execution, or fusion, if you will, are quite substantial. When you fuse a persona that shares its arcana with one of your bonds, it will gain great power. This will be a guiding principle for your forays into fusion. Try not to forget it. 
Moreover, there is one thing I must warn you about. You cannot create a persona that surpasses your current level. This is because the resulting persona would be too powerful for you to handle effectively. Now then, check the fusion results and choose a persona that suits your stature. This is the form your new persona is expected to take after fusion. It's possible for them to inherit skills they normally wouldn't gain. These skills and specialties are distinct from one another. Skills are traits that can be passed along through fusion. Select the skills you'd like to inherit. Will it gain new power? I wonder. Then let us begin. <laughs> I am Arsene, the other you who exists within. Though I may disappear this moment, I shall always be at your side. We shall meet again when your fate reaches its conclusion. <laughs> A stronger persona has been born from the body and blood of the old. It shall be your new strength. Its worth will be made clearer when you return to the field of battle. Gather personas and bring them here. Gather a great many, execute them, and continue to give birth to even stronger personas. Developing your powers as such will play an integral role in the stand against Ruin. So that your rehabilitation goes well, we have a variety of rituals to choose in regard to executions. And depending on the effort you put in, our master might consider further development of new rituals. Cry your tears of joy, inmate. Your heart is steadily gaining the strength of rebellion. It seems your rehabilitation is proceeding smoothly. A joyous fact indeed. In anticipation of this, I have prepared a gift for you. I hope that you shall accept it. All right. That is a thief's skill, allowing one to tap into their sixth sense and see what is hidden in the dark. I believe you can handle it now. May you continue devoting yourself to further rehabilitation. Now then, if you have any requests, we will heed them. with me the inmate needs our guidance you change your mind Justine you handle this these are the paths you have walked
this persona? You'll withdraw this persona? This is your power. What you want? A fee is required. This is your power. Done already? What? No slacking off! Something wrong? You were just standing around all of a sudden. Why are you spacing out like that? It's kind of hard to tell what you're thinking sometimes. Let's just say he's a man of high caliber. We're counting on you, Joker! So, where do we start? Let's head to the safe room we found last time. It's in the first floor of the West Building. It's pretty close to our usual entrance. It should be a pretty decent starting point. Safe room? It'll make sense when you see it. Well, let's head out. Reveal your true form. Okay, I'll show you an example first. You better watch closely. Zora! Use this opportunity to baton pass and swap your turn with someone else. Okay. Now strike the enemy's weakness and give the baton pass a try. All right! The baton pass made you stronger! Cool! Looking cool, Joker! All right, pass the baton and follow up! Another baton pass! I'll get him! Persona! Carmen! Nice one, keep it up! Don't get him! Let's keep pushing! Persona! Slam! 
Loosen up. Still! Now, let's carry out our plan. I'll reveal and your true you. form. By the myriad troops! Just what I'd expect from you, Joker. Let's go. A spectacular victory! Okay. Whoa, damn! Right. Huh? That was a little too easy. Nothing. Joker. How suspicious. Wanna get going? I'll reveal your true form. Now's our chance to strike! Go! Come! By the myriad troops! Keep up the pace! Set two enemies down for Joker! Oh, we all did great, huh? Mm. Nice work, team. Okay. Easy win. Hey, we're up. Three Let's enemies. go. Let's do it. All enemies defeated. Just what I'd expect from you, Joker. Step forward. All right. They were nothing. Okay. Look. Oh. Show me your true form! 
Shadow has a- Show me your true form! Persona! I don't think we're going any further this way. Should we check somewhere else? Wait, look up there! What about it? Are we throwing a rope over that and climbing it? Phantom thieves do things a bit more stylishly than that. And I know just what'll do the trick. Good. Seems like it fits properly. That's just a little something I've been working on in secret. The grappling hook lets you zip to hard-to-reach locations in a flash. You'll see what I'm talking about when you test it out. Go ahead, give it a try. Okay. Man, oh man, this is amazing! This is amazing! Strong looking one up ahead. Treasure chest. Uh, Joker. Well, oh, damn it.
suspicious. So let's be cautious. Hmm? Oh, this feeling. Maybe there's a safe room. This is a safe room. Okay. So let's be cautious. This room. There are tons of pictures of Suzui in here. Wait, it's all pics of her? <sighs> mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely. I feel even more motivated to do this now. I'm sure it'll feel awful, but we should search this room. There has to be something in here if he was hiding it with such an elaborate trick. Is this... a metal? Well, it has to be important. He went through all the trouble to hide it here, after all. I guess we'll take it then. Wait, there's something under the metal, too. It's a different map from the one we have. This is lucky. Let's take it with us. Aha! Our map's complete now! So is it gonna tell us where the treasure is? Yeah, look. It has to be here. That's a weird shaped building. Could it be a tower or something? Considering our current position, I'd say we're about halfway there. All right, let's hurry over there. No. Now that we know how much we have left, we can calculate the best way to pace ourselves. Let's keep exploring, but take breaks when you need to, Joker. but it's not making any moves. Be careful. If my prediction is correct, that one's a bit problematic for us. All right, then I'll go take care of it. Just be careful. These are hers. What the hell? It started moving after we attacked it. Look 
looks like it's exactly what I expected. Once we take it down... Hey, you two, watch this! The... it exploded? I'll explain later. Focus on the battle for now. There's another one like from earlier. Haphazard attacks on it will only make things tougher for us. It's probably best to take it down fast by striking its weakness and getting it to blow up. Alternately, we could put it to sleep or make it unable to move, then just deal with it later. Yeah, Let's go. All will be revealed. This is amazing. So let's be cautious. Strong shadow ahead. We should be careful. Joker! Jim? I get it. The gym's some kind of holy place for him. He's a god there. I can't believe he can think like that. Especially after what he did to Shiho. God, that bastard makes me so freaking sick. Just you wait, Kamoshida. I see. So you're the ones who tampered with the library. It seems my time waiting here has paid off. Just as that ape there said, this place is a holy ground for our great king, Kamoshida. It is preposterous for miscreants like yourselves to come waltzing in like this. You will pay for foolishly defying King Kamoshida with your lives. I knew this would happen. Well, we don't have a choice. Let's take it down! In my name. Look! He 
he's trying to do something. It's important to guard if you think you're in danger. Persona! I leveled up. Damn it. Chest. That's pretty shady. Joker. This room seems different from everywhere else we've seen so far. Yeah, and there's something super suspicious over there. That's... Come on, follow me! What is this? Just what I thought. A will seed. Palaces are locations that grew distorted from their original forms due to their ruler's cognitions. When such distortions coalesce into form, this is the result. I call it a will seed. Distortions coalesce into will seeds? Should I try explaining that again? Uh, just forget it. That's a will seed. Moving on. So, what do we do with it? We take it. It may not be as prized as a treasure, but it's still quite the rare find. Making it ours will only do us good. I think. Um, is it really okay to take it? Nothing shitty better happen when you take it. Like some trap going off or we all end up cursed. The will seed is ours. I guess nothing happened? There are more of these around here somewhere. As far as I can tell, there are two of them left. Huh? How can you tell? You smell them or something? Yeah, like how dogs can... Oh, but you're a cat. I am not a cat! I just seem like a cat. Okay, let's go. I'm 
getting some bad vibes from this guy. Watch out, Joker. <laughs> Some bad vibes from this guy. Watch out, Joker. Hmm, this sensation. I think there's a safe room. Reveal your true form. We're done here. Let's go. Mm. Nice work, team. Whoa, a new move. All right. That was so easy. I'm yawning. Show me your true form! Persona! Hmm, nice work, team! Okay. Shadow defeated! That was... Uh, there's a dangerous one.
bother with I'll reveal your true form let's go takes for me. For real? For real? Your true form. Another one of these? That shadow has a lot of health. This will be a pain. Joker, I taught you how to strike your opponent's weaknesses, right? If you could blind it or put it to sleep, you'd have an easier time doing real damage to it. Persona. Leveled up. Okay. All right. Shadow defeated. Something good inside. Show me your true form.
treasure to... Okay. A stylish victory. Write something. Come on. This place. Holy shit! That treasure thing's gotta be in here. Hey, what is this? It's floating in the air. <laughs> That's the treasure. We finally found it. Just hold on a second. I was planning on telling you more once we made it this far. Simply finding the treasure isn't enough. We'll need to make it materialize before we can steal it. What do you mean? Desires have no physical form by nature. Hence, we'll first need to make the real person aware that their desires are in fact a treasure. Once they're conscious that their desires might be stolen, the treasure will finally show itself. But how do we do that? We warn them. Tell them, they are going to steal your heart. So we're gonna send a calling card? Oh, that's totally what a phantom thief would do! Once we do that, the treasure will appear for certain. Uh, I think. That again? Either way, sounds like it's worth giving it a shot. Our infiltration route is secure. All that's left now is to pump out a calling card in reality, then come back to take the treasure. This is it, huh? That's the spirit. Once we send out the calling card, there will be no turning back. Just let me know when you're ready. We'll head back to the hideout and send out that calling card. Well then. Hey. What do you want to do? All right. Well done. challenge is coming up. I hope you're ready.
Yo. Now listen up. What do you want to do? Wow. Okay. Let's get started. Try to answer this. This is it. You do know. left now is to send out the calling card and take Kamoshida's heart. Couldn't we have just sent one at the beginning of all this? It's not that simple. A treasure won't stay materialized forever. Once the impression is gone, the treasure will disappear. I think it'll last around a day at most. The hell? That's like no time at all. Anyways, we can send a calling card right now, yeah? Let's do it and steal that bastard's heart. Now then. I've been waiting to hear you say that. Tomorrow's finally the day. So we send the calling card in the morning and carry out the plan by the end of the day, right? Correct. The effect won't last that long. Are you worried? <laughs> Waited too long. Perfect. Going to pull this off no matter what. So, who's going to write the card? Leave it to me! Why? Why? Why wouldn't it be me? This is important. Are you sure you can handle the pressure? I must agree. I really want to get him good. Let me write it. Uh, come on, please. Yeah, I got this. Hey, are you sure about this? If they find out our identities, all this work will be for nothing. I know, I know. All right then. Tomorrow it is. You'd better not slack off on this. Hey. Oh, yeah.
Okay. What's up? Oh! Oh! Nice! Okay. That's incredible! Card. I heard it was already posted by the time everyone got here this morning. Sir Suguru Kamoshida, the utter bastard of lust. We know how shitty you are, and that you put your twisted desires on students that can't fight back. That's why we have decided to steal away those desires and make you confess your sins. This will be done tomorrow, so we hope you will be ready. From the Phantom Thieves of Hearts. Wow. Not bad, huh? I looked up a bunch of similar stuff online for reference. Um, yeah. I know what you wanted to say, but it sounded like an idiot trying to be an adult. Your logo's a little lacking, too. Okay, you know what? That ain't true. Did Mr. Kamashita do something wrong? Does this mean the rumors are true? Wait a sec. Is someone gonna take something from Mr. Kamashita? What's with this weird logo? And who are these Phantom Thieves of Hearts people? It got everyone excited, so it's all good, yeah? Who's responsible for this? Look at that. A predictable reaction for someone who knows what we mean by distorted desires. I think it's hitting him pretty hard. Did you do this, or was it you? Was it you two? So you're playing dumb? <laughs> it's not a problem. You'll be expelled soon enough anyway. Come, steal it if you can. Judging from Kamoshida's response, I'm sure we had an effect on his palace. Does that mean the treasures appeared? We'll be able to get it today, right? It's not just today. It's only today. The impact of seeing a calling card doesn't last long. And it cannot be repeated. This will be our one chance to steal the treasure. One day's more than enough for us. I'll just add this. <laughs> 